To an outsider such as myself, Bulfast can seem a bewildering and desolate place. However, having been dispatched here by my editor many months ago, the journalistic equivalent of drawing the short straw, I can confirm that it is actually much worse than it looks. The local stock response to my genuine questions when attempting to report on specific incidents or simply trying to understand daily life in Belfast slums is to inform me that my mother is in fact my father, or to use a regional vernacular, your ma is your da. A baffling gender-bending retort that whilst it confuses a well-educated Englishman such as myself, brings titters of delight and cries of a seemingly Ulster Scots phrase, RG scundered mate, from the giddy spectators. How queer. There are very few things which unite both sides of the religious divide here, but one is that nobody likes a tout, something that renders my journalistic endeavours nigh on impossible, and the other is that playing practical jokes on an Englishman is the height of hilarity, something that can grow rather tiresome. An example of one such occasion was when I informed some of the locals recently that it was in fact my birthday. They sang a rendition of Happy Birthday, which they had adapted, so that the words bore the ludicrous claim that I was in fact born in the zoo, with a selection of animals that included a rather rotund kangaroo. My insistence that this was not the case, and that I was in fact born in Charing Cross Hospital by way of a caesarean section due to my exceptionally long torso, drew cackles of laughter from the assembled women and children. One woman with legs that would have not looked out of place holding up a billiards table informed me that they were simply pulling my leg. A leg that was nearly blown off that evening when I, against my better judgment, decided to leave the safety of my hotel room in the Europa Hotel to nip across to the Crown Bar for a solitary pint of porter to mark the anniversary of my birth, only to exit the hotel's front door just as a controlled explosion was being carried out a few yards away. No porter for me, it seems. Perhaps next year.